Hello there, I am John Go with Marthbond. In the last part, we took on the second half of Magicant, and we made it all the way to this many, many statue of this boss. And, uh, let's just take him on, I guess. He's an evil part inside Nessa's brain, so he needs to be, uh, you know, he needs to be eliminated, I guess. I'm the evil part of your brain. You can, you can't beat me, because you are the one who forced me into being. Oh, you want to bet? Let's go. Okay, here's night. Here's Nessa's nightmare. It's actually considered to be like one of the hardest, if not the hardest, boss in the game. But hopefully, we can take this thing out easily. I'm gonna start off with just using both my um, bag of dragonites, though, because they're actually helpful. I wanted to save my bag of dragonites just for this boss battle, because it's pretty tough, you know. And I want to finally use bag of dragonites to see how cool they are. They, as you saw, we just turned into a dragon, which is pretty cool. Let's use my other bag of dragonite. So, yeah. Okay, put up a shield, the PSI shield, I guess. Yikes, <laughs> yeah. It must turn into the dragon, yay. Two turns in a row. Let's bash this thing. It's gonna use PSI Rock and Alpha. It has PSI Rock and Alpha. I think it has PSI Rock and Omega, too. So just keep that in mind. Nest Mist, of course. Smash Attack, awesome. Yeah, that's not good. Okay, so let's choose PSI Rock, uh, Recover, uh, Beta. Yeah. Okay, oh man, Ness can't stop crying, now he might miss and stuff, ah. Just keep on trying to bash him, you know? The fuck did the attack, dang it. We got this though, we, we still have some, we still have a chance, you know? I'm not backing down. Yeah, let's just we... Oh man, we keep on missing though. It's not good. That is not good. My foot gamma, okay. Spin out a shield, okay. Okay, I'm stronger. That's not good. And it's not moving, okay. So yeah, that... It seemed like it could have gave it did give me a little bit of trouble, like a little bit, but that's all there is to it, I guess. Just a bag of dragonites will help in this fight, so you want to use them if you have them. And plus, if you get a bag of dragonite and magic cancel, so that helps too. Ness gained eight eighty nine thousand four experience. How awesome is that? Ness heard a familiar voice at the center of the Sea of Eid Eden. Uh, Gagas's goal is to destroy you. Listen carefully. Everything in the universe, that's actually a typo. It's, it says unverse, but it's supposed to say universe. You think that, well, it's, this is a really important cutscene that, like, people, that it could be spelled right, but I guess it just may have slipped by. It's okay. Typos happen. Everything in the universe could be destroyed at the hands of Gygas. But he and his followers are in trouble, are also in trouble. The Apple of Enlightenment has foretold that Gygas attempts I guess is the temple will, fall, will fail. There we go. It is because of an, of the existence of a boy named Ness. That's me. Listen. Free your mind and know what you must do. Your destiny has already been decided. You, I, where should we go? You know, deep within the reaches of your mind. Sa Sa Saturn. Saturn Valley, yes. Go to the valley where the Mr. Saturn lived. You'll get something new there. Soon Magicant will be no more. We must be quick. Yes, really. Heard his own voice. Go to Saturn Valley. Go to Saturn Valley now. It's pretty cool right here. Ness was filled with the power of gi the giant step. Ness's speed increased by five. Ness's vitality increased by five. Ness was filled with the power of Lilliput steps. Ness's guts increased by five. Ness's luck increased by five. Ness was filled with the power of, of the Milky Well. Ness's speed increased by five. Ness's IQ increased by five. Ness was, was filled with the power of the Magnet Hill. Ness's vitality went increased by five. Ness's luck increased by five. Ness was filled with the power of the rainy circle. Ness's guts increased by five. Ness's IQ increased by five. Ness was filled with the power of the 
pink cloud. Thus was speed increased by five. Thus was guts increased by five. Thus was filled with the power of the Lumi hole. Thus was luck increased by five. Thus was IQ increased by five. Thus was filled with the power of fire of the fire spring. Thus was speed increased by five. Thus was luck increased by five. Instantly, Ness's mind cleared and realized that he had possessed great power. At that moment, Ness's psychic powers radically expanded. Ness gained 200,000 experience. Ness is level 85. Sweet, maximum HP 150. 150 cheese. That's Rax, uh, maximum HP went up by 370. And finally, he realized he had the power of teleport beta. Ness made all of the hidden powers his own. Ness absorbed the power of the land inside his heart, into his heart, and Magic Ant was no more. Ness, you can wake up. Your friends are waiting for you. It's time to get up. It's time to get up. That was pretty cool. <laughs> the soundstone that Nest used to have is now gone. What happened, Nest? You have been unconscious for a long time. You kept saying something. Sudden Valley? What's with? What, uh, what's waiting for us there? Anyway, we need to get. We need to teleport. And right here, it's impossible for you can crash. So it automatically does um, Nest's. PSI teleport beta for you, which is pretty cool. Goodbye, Fire Springs. <laughs> Hello, Sun Valley. Okay, so I remember in this, I think there was this Mr. Sun who said he'd always help us out um, in return, so let's talk to him. I do what I say. Uh, cross heart. Okay. Hey, look up there. It's Mr. It's Dr. Andonis, the Mr. Sun, and uh, Apple Kid. Yay. So, uh, no problem here. That's no problem there, I guess. Let's talk to Mr. Andonuts. Or Dr. Andonuts. Yaha! The Mr. Saturns are incredibly folk, and the Apple Kid, he is a most ex exceptional, exceptional young man. Very different from other kids. Well, anyway, the, f uh, the prototype phase distorter has been stolen. Someone resembling a pig wearing clothes took Mr. Saturn captive and stole the device. Well, that could have been pokey, because... He's always causing trouble, you know? Start the Apple Kid. Excellent, excellent. Everything proceeded as planned. Dr. Andronitz, Mr. Sutton, and I worked together and finally completed the phase disorder. The purpose of the device is to enable instantaneous travel through space and time. In this prototype, you can you, you can only travel uh, to other to different points within the same point time period, within the same time period. It is, it is able, however, to search out the locations of enemies. <clears throat> right now, it is indicating the presence, the present, the presence of enemies in the lost over underworld. And we go inside the prototype, I guess. Oh man, bummer. <laughs> hmm, it doesn't work. One thing is missing, but that. One material cannot normally be found on the earth. The material I'm thinking of can, came from a meteorite I, that fell when I was much younger. Have you seen a, a meteorite anywhere recently? Well, at the beginning of the game, yes, but not recently. But yes, I have seen it. Eureka, that's it. We just need a piece of that of the meteorite. I can synthesize the material. Uh, Zexanite. Um, I doubt that your mortal enemy guy guess or whatever will allow you to go to Onet and get a piece of them, the meteorite. But now Onet is in his evil hands. You must go though, so take every possible precaution. The Mr. Sun have introduced some of their new developments at their shop. Please check there before you leave. 
I wonder what Onet is like at this point in time. Jeez, I wonder is too. I mean, like, where could it be, man? What could it be like now? So let's go to the shop and actually take his advice and see what the Mr. Sound have come up with and what they're selling now. So yeah, let's, let's just go up there. And there's also, you know, of course, the receiver phone so you can save too. So that's pretty cool. I think it's the third one right over here, the first one from the door that has the best, uh, has upgraded items, I guess. I mean, I forgot to read your dialogue. So I'll read it this time. Okay, hi, hi, hi. You come uh, buying, you can smell too. You can sell too. Um, I, Mr. Sad and Doing, can do all for you. What do you want to do? Zoom? What do you want? Zoom? Buy, I guess. Okay, we can buy the flame panel, the rain panel, and the night panel, the piggy jelly. I'm gonna buy the piggy jelly just to have it in my inventory, honestly. It's a cool name too for an item. So let's give that to, I guess, Ness. Yeah, Ness. Let's give this to Ness. Okay, yeah. Um, no, there's another thing else I need. Here's a receiver phone, so I'm gonna end the part right here. So this has been the moment with my once part, and the next part will take on. Probably going back to Nonet and trying to get a piece of that meteorite we saw at the beginning of the game, where it was on top of that mountain near our house, or area. So yeah, so this has been Janko again. I would like to thank you for again, goodbye, and I'll see you guys next time on my Earth Final Let's Play.